Hey everybody, welcome back to Raven Hot Coins, guys, and we have another box of nickels. Been a little while since we've done a nickel search or a coin roll search from start to finish, so we are going to get through this box. We're hoping to find some really good stuff. As you can see, the background is starting to grow again. By popular demand, I am bringing it back, and so... Uh, we're going to get into this. We'll open it up right now and see if we have circulated nickels. That's what we're always keeping our fingers crossed for. So here we go. And we have... Dun, 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 dun. Come on. Can we see it? Yes. Circulated nickels. And I should have known, but you can never take for granted... The reverse on some nickels. I've seen some brand new nickels, uh, you know, 2018s for the most part look kind of bad already. So, hey, we're going to get into this. We'll be back with the world famous nickel mids and see what we find. All right, everybody. So we've gotten through the box and we've built our nickel mids and no obvious enders as of yet. Well, hey, you guys know how it goes. Um, just because you don't find it on the end doesn't mean you won't find it somewhere deep in the coins. So we're going to see what we find. Raven Hog Coins. Stay tuned. All right, guys. So we got through the first of the nickel mids, and here are our finds. This is the first one we got here. So let's see here. A 1958, and it does have a mint mark. It looks like a Denver. So starting off with a 58 Denver. Going into what is up next, a 1954, and this one is a Denver, guys. At least it looks like one, but I've had this before where uh, I mess it up. <laughs> All right, so then we have two 1940s, I believe these are. No, oh, this is a 49. I put it in the wrong order, and this one, though, is... Looks like a San Francisco to me. Oh, yeah, it was right order. <laughs> All right, guys. So my voice is a little messed up and had a little bit low on my energy because I'm fighting a little bit of a cold. But, hey, we got to push on through. And I want to see what this one is here. And it looks like another San Francisco. Finally, last but not least, we got a 19. Look at that, 39. Philly, so not too bad. Uh, it's rather common nickel, the 39, but um, still cool to find it. And there's a lot of them out there. But hey, keep searching, guys, because you never know what you are going to find. We'll get through the next nickel mid, Raven Hot Coins. Stay tuned. All right, everybody, as you see. Oh, you know what? I forgot to get through one roll. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. I'm going to open it real quick and see if there's anything special. There does look to be something interesting there. Uh, just a really dark black beauty, which these are cool. This one's a 99D. So I do keep the black beauties aside because that is a type of air in the coin for it to allow to get that dark, guys. So, uh, or I should say everyone, because there are more than just guys watching the channel but i'm gonna get through this roll real quick with you all and uh then we'll see what we found besides the roll so hope you guys are doing good Ooh, look at that a 47 very cool and uh, nothing else too special in here but guys so here we go we got a black beauty a 1947 actually that makes two so check it out the 2009 Street continues. Yes, this one's actually got a really nice look to it. Just got a little dirt up in the corner there, but no worries at all. Then we found a 1951, and that's a Philly. And you just saw the 1947, but I didn't flip it over to see what it was. Let's see if we can get this to focus in a little bit better there. And it looks like, ah, uh, come on. You know what? I'm going to use my handy dandy. Yep, it's a D. <laughs> All right, and the next one in 1947. This one is also a Denver. So 247 Denvers. Then 
1941. Philly. Last but not least, another 1939. And this one, guys, is also a Philly. So we have three more nickel mids to get through, guys. Hope we find something good. Ravenock Coins, stay tuned. Okay, everybody, we've gone through the third nickel mid. Really cool finds, guys and gals. <laughs> uh, starting off with another Black Beauty. I don't usually keep a 64 galore, but since it's a Black Beauty, I'm going to hold on to it. You know, it's got that, got that little nick right there. It's pretty cool. Look at this, though, guys. This one is a 1956. And the fields and everything are really, really nice in the front. Um, but, of course, like all the coins of that era, the, the reverse is so-so. Uh, the fields are really nice, but Monticello's got the wear, you know, the normal wear and tear on it. And is... Uh, but still a really nice looking coin. It does have some of the steps left in the middle, but not on the sides. But still, that, that one really surprised me. Then we have a 1955. We'll focus that in a little better. Flip it over. And this one, I believe, is a San Francisco. No, it's a Denver. And, huh. Looks interesting. I'm going to have to check that out again later. All right, so the next coin up is a 1946 and this one is from philly then guys guess what we have war huh <gasps> nickel yes a 1943 there it is philly so very very cool happy about that but then check this one out guys this one is a 1940 and it has some interesting stuff going on here in the background it looks like somebody put some something caustic on it uh but it's really still interesting find it's a 1940 the mint mark is a san francisco so 1940s a little bit of character to that we have two more nickel mids to get through hoping we find more silver maybe some buffaloes you just never know raven hot coins stay tuned all right everybody we got through the fourth Nickel mid, and we only have one find, and that is this 1940. Is it a nine? <laughs> My eyes are playing tricks on me. Yeah, 1949, and the mint mark is San Francisco. So, very, very cool. There, there we go. All right, so we got one more nickel mid, guys. Hoping we find something really good. We'll be back soon. Raven Hot Coins, stay tuned. All right, everybody, welcome back. So we have gone through the final nickel mid. We have a few finds. No more silver and not a buffalo, but we did get another 1949. And I believe this one again is San Francisco. Yes, it is a San Francisco. And look at how dirty these paws get after doing a box, guys. <laughs> All right, and the next one is a 1940 Philly. Very cool. And last but not least was a visit from Canada, eh? And this one is a 1985 Beaver Nickel, but unfortunately, somebody used it to do some type of welding. This is uh, post-mint damage from welding material stuck to the nickel, but hey, at least it's something cool, and we still did find, we still, did, we still found a war, huh, nickel, 1943 Philly, as well as some black beauties, and the 2009 streak stayed alive, so guys, make sure you keep hunting, because you keep looking, you're gonna find something, if you want to correspond, it's ravenhotcoins at gmail.com, our P.O. box is 721-296 Norman, Oklahoma, 73070. Make sure to support the channels out there, guys, and like always, take care of one another. Raven Hot Coins, have a great day.